My name is Jessie Dyer and I work here at L.L. Bean. L.L. Bean was founded in 1912 by an avid outdoorsman, Leon Liam Wood Bean. His first creation was the main hunting shoe. That boot, most commonly known as the L.L. Bean boot, is our most iconic product and we've made this for 110 years. If a customer has a pair of well-worn boots and is not ready to give them up, we can easily resew them and bring them back to like new condition. In order to replace and put a new bottom on it, we will be removing the upper from this boot. It will go in the saw and we will start detaching that with the saw on the blade. The boots get clamped, they get put into the saw and it cuts right down through the bottom of the boot. Once the boot comes out of the machine, it does have a piece of the brush guard that is still attached to the leather. We remove this in order to have the leather all nice and clean so that it can fit on the new bottom, snug and complete. We call this stripping the boot. We use a flat knife as well as scissors to cut the stitches away from the upper. Once this happens, we can hand pick all of the stitches that remain behind. In order to help us get these stitches out easier, we actually have a rub machine. And this is very much like a rotating bristle. The outside of the leather boot actually brushes up against that and it helps loosen the stitches so that we can pull them out easier and have a nice clean finish to the leather upper. We then pick out all of the threads from the bottom part of the upper so that it can be restitched onto the new bottom nice and clean and not have any straggling pieces of thread left behind. We're now going to start reassembly. In this step, we are actually going to move the old heel protector and attach a new one. This particular boot is looking for a brand new bottom, so we were replacing it with the exact same bottom that the customer received when they purchased the boot originally. In order for this to properly attach, we make sure that there is any dust or debris or stitches that are all removed. Once that happens, we actually apply cement to both the new bottom boot as well as the leather upper. Once that is complete, we move right on to the vamping process. We have a vamping machine that we've done, and this is all done by hand. So this particular machine will drop three needles down into the boot with stitches and complete the stitching process to the boot bottom. We use great care to line up the holes. At times, this requires slowing down the machine and really taking a fine look as to where those holes are. Once we complete the vamp, we move over to the packing station. Here is where we will give it one final look to make sure that quality is ensured. Before boxing, we make sure that we are wiping down any debris that could be left behind. We replace the lace and the inner sole on each boot just due to wear. We try to get everything right back to its original status. Now that the boots are complete, we go to packing them up and shipping them out to another happy customer. I'm really happy at how these boots came out and I cannot wait for our customer to see them.